to another vlog. <laughs> vlog. It's hard to talk. Do y'all see my face? <laughs> it is swollen. So I go to the dentist tomorrow to see why my face is swollen. It's not hurting. It's just swole. But anyway, welcome to another vlog. So, happy Monday. Um, so today, I'm about to meet... I moved into a new salon. And I'm about to meet... Um, well, the owner wants everyone in the salon to go to lunch. It's Salon Suites. And it's four of us. So we're about to go to lunch. And she want to have a little powwow meeting Things of that such. So that's what we about to do today. Me and my swollen face and all is out here, honey. I try. I'm, I put all my face, my hair over this, over this side, so it can kind of cover it. But you can still see it. <laughs> but anywho, let's go. <laughs> the meeting went well. We just talked about, um, you know, like social media, branding, marketing. Um, what we want to do, because we still, she still want it as like a team, but we all, we're all, we all are in, is this right here, is the swollen face. She still want, I mean, we all are our own business, but because we walk, work around each other, she still want to be like a team. So we still do team things like um, go to hair shows, uh do photo shoots things like that which i love because i'm missing that because i did work at a full salon before and we did team things and even though the salon <laughs> was kind of chaotic but we did do we went out we went to shows stuff like that and that's what i do miss um that's the only thing about working in a salon suite unless you just got a group of a stylish friends that you hang around and that y'all do stuff together but yeah so I like that. So we just uh, did that. We ate a little lunch. I thought we was going somewhere. We didn't go nowhere. They She brought lunch in. And we just had a little. She wanted to do a toast. And we toasted. She gave me the rest of this. We toasted to this Andre Mango Mimosa. Which wasn't that bad. The, for a pre-made, pre-mixed mimosa. It wasn't that bad. But. And then we just gave our input. Um. Teaching them how to do stuff, social media, things like that. So, all in all, it went well. And, yeah. So, that was that. All right. <laughs> and happy Tuesday. So, I was on my way to the dentist to see what's going on here. And I see they sent me a text this morning because my phone was dead. They sent me a text this morning. They have to reschedule. And when they're going to reschedule freaking next week <laughs> so I hope that it don't get any worse the swelling has even though it's still a little swollen it's gone down a bit and it's just like pressure it's not hurting it's just pressure so she did put me on a cancellation list in case somebody cancel and I'm hoping if they do get a cancellation it's not when I'm working but yeah and I can feel it when I talk and I'll come to conclusion that it's an abscess. Because I could feel it like right up in here. So yeah, I think that's what it is. But still, I want them to look. I want to get it looked at sooner rather than later. Restore. St Dog, stop it. This dog is going to make me hurt her. But anywho. Alright y'all. I made it back home. And um, from the grocery store. And I'm about to juice. Make my favorite green juice. And yeah, this dog. If you don't leave my feet alone. Stop it. Quit. <laughs> Shut up. Quit, quit it. Uh huh. Don't leave my feet alone. <laughs> Hush, but I'll put you in your crate. Be quiet. Oh my gosh. She is such a freaking menace. You still got... You still talking junk? Oh, really? Okay. So, before I make... Well, Ma'am, shut up. 
before I make this chest. Let's make a smoothie. <laughs> Very smoothie. Look at my grandma back down. She thought she was hot to trot. <laughs> <laughs> Hey y'all, I'm um, trying to get this lighting right because I'm in the car, as y'all can see. But happy Friday. So the last time I recorded was a little bit of Wednesday morning when I came into the salon. But I'm at the salon again. I'm just here to pick up uh, something. But I just want to show y'all because I didn't, I don't know. I did give y'all a full scope, a full show of the salon. But yes, so it's only four of us in here. We all have our own salon suites. But yes, I'm happy to be in a salon with freaking plumbing, okay? <laughs> but all right, let me show y'all. <laughs> so first of all, we safe up in these streets. I have to let this gate up. <laughs> let me do that. The salon sweet beauty hair and body. <laughs> so go in. And I just turn the lights on. This is our little lobby. And that is a gate on the window that comes up. And we see that's that one. Nikki. Somebody's in here. They don't have their sign up. We have Salon Dupree, she's the owner. This is my room. I gotta get my sign. But yes, let me open this. And this is, of course, I had to put my picture up. That's my favorite picture. Lord, I'm falling. This is it. I like this mirror because the, the, the light come on around it. I just don't have it plugged up, but yes, this is, and here is the bowl. I love the bowl, and the chair comes out. Woohoo! Clients love that, but yeah, I I usually put this dryer next door, what if I don't need it? But uh, I'm gonna need it in the morning for a client. Let me put this down. Eh. But yes, so that is the salon, you guys. All right. <laughs> one more thing. One more thing. I like it because it has, I like this thing, soft clothes. <laughs> I don't know. It's something about soft clothes, drawers, and cabinets. All of it's like that. I love it. Yes. Okay, let's get out of here.
Okay, y'all. So I'm I'm sitting here filling out this uh money order to mail to my my last rent payment for the old salon. To uh, we gotta mail it. But anyway, I wanted to talk fast and briefly about what's been going on in social media. First things first, let's talk about Diddy. Diddy is done. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. Diddy is done. You know, I've been hearing things about Diddy since the 90s. Not about the abusiveness, but about him being on the flip side. Um, so, yeah. But seeing that video, even though everything Cassie said, I believed from the beginning. I believed Aubrey from the beginning. When she started talking after Danny D. Kane split. I believed Aubrey from the beginning. I believed Cassie from the beginning. And whoever else had to say something about Diddy. I believe them because after that video I saw of him in his office when somebody one of his employees couldn't get something done and he got it done and he started just yelling and tearing up the office talking about what is it what is it you need me to do I get what I want every time I get it I get what I want I was like he crazy mm-hmm he is crazy okay so enough of that now I've been seeing on TikTok lately this the denouncing of your fraternity and sorority I don't have an issue with you denouncing but why you have to announce the denounce okay what happened to the days of just if you you just don't affiliate with the sorority or fraternity no more you stop wearing paraphernalia you're not active you don't go to any activities you just distance yourself and that's it why you gotta announce it to the world I don't understand that. And then I saw somebody denounce Spelman College. Like, how you denounce an HBCU saying HBC, all HBCUs is demonic? Um, My HBCU, Savannah State University, was not demonic. Oh, and they said that about sororities and fraternities. My sorority, Zeta Phi Beta Sorority Incorporated, is not demonic. We do whatever kind of rituals they talking about and praising the Greek God. No. I must have missed that part because I, I don't remember that. But anyway, it's just it's just foolishness. What do y'all think about that? Like the denouncing. Do you think they should be announcing the denounce? I don't think so. All right. Let me finish filling this out and before my storage because I'm on my phone before my storage get full. <laughs> People, we are back in the salon. This morning is like 630 Yes, so I'm about to do this client and then I'm going to a workout class. Um, and yes, because it's 6.30 a.m. Okay, not p.m. But a.m. <laughs> so yeah, all righty. Hey y'all, so I done with my client and I'm on my way to the gym. I'm taking this. It's called a BBL class. It's a Brazil, not Brazilian. It's a booty butt lift class. What is he doing? Zach, I gotta go, dude. <laughs> what are y'all doing, my cousin? I made it. <sighs> Let me run in here. Because it started at 1030 and it's about to be 1030. But yes, okay, let me go. We're just in 30 minutes. <laughs> Brenda! <laughs> Y'all, I just got out of that class. The class was only 30 minutes. When she said it was 30 minutes, I was like, oh, she gonna kick our butt in 30 minutes. And did she? She did. <laughs> I'm sweating. Oh my God. But it was a good workout because I ain't work out none this week. So yeah, that was a good workout. I will be back. I'm going to try to come because she have it every other Saturday, the BBL Saturday, the booty butt lift class. And boy, boy, oh boy. <laughs> but it was a good workout. And now uh, I'm about to go home, take a shower because I want to get my toes done. <sighs> yes. Okay. <laughs> well, I thought I was getting my uh, pedicure today, but I guess not. The nail salon closed early for Memorial Day. I'm like, what? No. No. 
I'm nice, fresh, and showered from that workout. Y'all, I am going back to that workout every other Saturday. I'm going to make sure I am off or just do a client early in the morning like I did today. And then go to that class because that was good. So, yes. Um, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So, oh, I went to Ulta because for my nails, I like doing these, uh, what do they call these? Gel, I just call them sticker polish. But I like doing these instead of paying all that money to get my nails done. But anywho, and they last a long time too. But yes. So let me go home. I guess my, my rest of my plans for today is ruined. Well, it was nothing but get my nails done and that's it. I gotta do my grandma hair. I'll do that when I get back so I can get that over with. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> hey y'all, happy Sunday. Um, so today is the day before Memorial Day. So me and uh, one of my friends and her co-worker are going on the island, St. Thomas Island. And they're having a little like jazz thing um, in the park, kinda. But first we're going to eat at this place called Half Shell. And I looked at their menu and I'm like, yes, I want to go. Y'all know me. I love seafood. I don't eat meat, so I love seafood. But anyway, that's where we're going. And yeah, of course, I'm going to bring y'all along and record as much as I can. But yes, and it is hot as heck out here. <laughs> All right, y'all.